So we've all been using SmartNearest Proxy for a long time now. We've used it on our phones, TVs, and even streaming devices like Fire TV Stick, Nvidia Shield, what have you. And we've always emphasized that you set it up on your router, that way every one of your devices can access it. But most of your streaming devices come with an Android operating system. And if you didn't know, they can run a VPN as well. So if you're curious like I was when I heard this for the first time, here's how you set up SmartDNS Proxy's VPN on your Android-based streaming devices like Firestick or Nvidia Shield. First of all, make sure that you enable apt from unknown sources on both devices. To do that, navigate to settings and then go to My Fire TV. Open the developer options and from there, just tap on the option which says apps from unknown source and select allow. Next, you need to sideload SmartDNS Proxy's VPN app on your Fire TV and Fire TV stick. A better way to sideload apps on your Fire TV stick is via an Android app called Easy Fire Tools. Download the Easy Fire Tool app on your Android smartphone and then download the SmartDNS Proxy app from the sites like APK Pure. Once you're done, just connect the Easy Fire tool with your Fire TV stick and tap on the app you want to install. And this will be installed on Fire TV stick as well. Once you're done installing SmartDNS Proxy's VPN APK inside your Fire TV stick, launch and connect to the server. Wait, that doesn't look that easy. The UI is stretched out and you can't even see any cursor. Well, that's because this app is originally made to work on mobile screens. So when emulated on a bigger screen, it's super scaled. We've left a note for the developer and hopefully it'll get fixed in the future. Thankfully, with the mouse toggle app will help us navigate here. Sideload the mouse toggle for Fire TV and start the service. Now come back to Smart VPN and press play button twice, you should be able to see the cursor ball. One thing to note here is that the app only works on non 4K variant of the Fire TV stick. So if you're using a Fire TV 4K, you can use an actual mouse with the help of a micro USB host OTG cable. Navigate through the app, select your country and server, and then hit connect. Now you'll be able to see that your browsing country has changed. Once this is out of the way, now let's see how you can connect SmartVPN on Nvidia Shield. So to do this, first head over to the Play Store and download Puffin TV Browser, which will be used to surf the web and download further files. The installation process of a VPN on Nvidia Shield is pretty much the same as Firestick. First, you need to allow installation from unknown sources. For NVIDIA Shield, long press the back button until you see a menu pop up from the right side of the screen with settings. Scroll down to find security and restrictions under personal tab. Open this and select the app which you want to allow with permission. Do you know that in NVIDIA Shield, there's no option to enable this feature by default. So you have to do it manually every time or just allow the browser or file manager with the APK with permission and there won't be any problem. Next, download SmartVPN APK from Puffin Browser and then install it. Once you're done installing, you'll see that there's no icon of the app in the app drawer. That's because Nvidia Shield doesn't promote the user to install third-party side-loaded apps into the system. To counter this situation, we have to find a third-party launcher which is capable of showing all the apps. ATV Launcher is the most suitable in my case, so go to Play Store and download ATV Launcher. Once you're done downloading, just open it, scroll down to find Smart VPN there. Open it and use the right analog stick to select the server with the mouse pointer and then hit connect using the pointer. You'll be able to use SmartDNS Proxy's VPN on Nvidia Shield. To check if it's working or not, switch to the nearest server from your physical location. So make sure you pick the server with SmartVPN in it. Switch to Netflix and search for shows like The Office or Killing. After turning on VPN, it should show you and start streaming just fine. How cool is that?
So yeah, that's how you set up Smart VPN on streaming devices like Fire TV Stick or Nvidia Shield to unblock geo-stitched content on sites like Netflix, Hulu, Pandora, what have you. Do check out our other videos on Fire TV tips and tricks, and there's another one coming for Nvidia Shield, so look out for that one. I'm Vamsi, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.